rescue mission. I really hope she's nice. I'm sure she'll be thankful in her own way. If she's not, we'll lock her up again, won't we? Don't worry. You have two strong women to protect you. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, it's so funny. Not all the time, but mostly, yes. Ha! Quick! Quick! You did it! That was nightly. So, here's our fugitive. You saved her, Hugo. Want to say a proper hello? Hmm. I'll go with you. You've done the difficult part. Don't startle her and it'll be just fine. What if she screams? Screaming's not biting. Just say to yourself, it can happen. And that's all. I'll try. See? It's easy. They don't all scream. Yes. She's nice. All right. She's <laughs> saved. You've overcome your fear. And I want to see that sanctuary. Let's go? Yes. Go. Your dad's waiting for you. She's not moving. She will. She's her own master. There wasn't any goat in your dream. No. But maybe there will be now. Who wouldn't want a dream of goats? Thank you for your offerings. Sorry to push you out, but the ceremony will begin soon. Hmm. Soldier. Oh, no problem. Make sure no trouble arises. Yes, we had enough violence yesterday. The child must have hated it. Climb up. We'll be especially careful. Don't worry. Good. Well, thank you, Arno. That was to be expected. <laughs> oh. Mind the drop. Yes. What do we do with the last offerings? They stay here for now. We'll bring them up there after the ceremony. Careful. Looks like they really like their privacy. How will we cross that gate? There's no way I can attack them. We get jailed or worse. I have a trick. This prism focuses sunlight. It can scorch tall grass. You get smoke. You get any guard's attention. Wow. Let's try. Tell me where you want a guard to go. Tall grass only. The child knows. Yes, that's what's important. Try that one. It worked. Great. Move as soon as he's gone. It never lasts long. Got it. Must be nothing. Your drink will help you. Time to burn some grass. Out of smoke. They make it so easy. It was another false alarm. I knew it. Damn yeah, right. These damn uniforms. You know the Count. He likes to keep it formal. Yeah. Yeah, well. Next time, we'll ask to stand guard near the ruins. There's more shade, and I'd like to see the procession for once. Sophia, your present would help. Let's capture the light. <gasps> Where's that smoke coming from? Come on, it works. Nothing to worry about. Forget it. That prism is magic. It is. But we're not there yet. Let's 
see what can be done. This should make things a bit easier. Through here, I guess. Oh, it's very high. Oh, wow. Stick to the wall. Keep going. It makes me dizzy. Oh, shit. Bloody hell. You're right. There. Oh, all right, all right. I don't like your stunts, kid. I want to go. Yes, let's keep moving. We're here. We made it. You all right, Hugo? I'm sorry. It was way too risky. I'm better now. Thank you, Sophia. There's nothing. It's just... My worst nightmare. We should walk a bit. On solid ground. Oh, all those flowers. That must be for their ceremony. Soldiers! Soldiers, to cover quick. Soon. Open your eyes. Heavy armor. Wow. Oh no, really kept them on their toes. Looks like we're crossing a line here. Getting spotted's not an option anyway. We'd either get killed or kicked off the island. Smoke? What's going on? Make it so easy. Nothing. Hey, the captain Fine. there's no soldier inside the sanctuary, all right? Got it! We'll be sacrilege anyway. The child needs peace, not weapons.
there? It was a weird noise, but a check. Great. False alarm. something. Just a false alarm. Nothing around. making that swag is every time nothing fine We're doing it, my friends. We're getting there. <sighs> yes. How do you feel, Hugo? I feel funny. But good. I'm sure there's something inside the mountain. I feel it, too. Well, I'm trusting you both. Up we go. All right. <sighs> oh. Everyone, it is almost time. Gather round, please. It's the Count and the Countess. It seems we're right on time. Hugo, look at 
this? Is it from the bird? It's up to you. I say it is. Then it would be honored that you wear it. Keep it for when we see it. Yes. I'll give it back then. Careful with the drop here. We're still uh -huh. waiting for a few latecomers. Feel free to come closer in the meantime. Latecomers? I'd say that's us. What are we going to do? We'll... think about it. Friends and children, today marks the longest day of the year. The light of the summer solstice shines upon us once again. And yet, in these cold hallways, hidden from the sun, the child of embers still slumbers. It is time to bring the flame of the phoenix... The phoenix? ...to his dormant That's embers. Your bird. Thus will we prove that we deserve to care for him. Like mother. Like father. Let us pray together before we enter. Come. What do you think? Bold, but believable. Are we dressing up? Open your mind and heart. It is now time to tell his tale. So that it is never forgotten. What do we do? Let's follow them or not. And do what they say. They mustn't recognize us. Yes. Come on. Centuries ago, a child was born on this land. His heart was blessed by the sun, from which he inherited the flame that rules everything. And so was born the child of fire. What? His flame shone over the world. He blessed it with his perfume, his laughter, his joy. Of all places, Lacuna was his home. It became a land of life and peace. A place to heal, to thrive. Lacuna became a cradle of light. But light tempts evil. And evil knows no mercy. Come. A child on a throne, in an order temple. It's him, the child of Embers. Take your place at our sides. Look, the drawing. It's the carrier of the macula. That fresco was in Mother's laboratory at home. Please kneel. Evil found the child inside these very halls. It fed on his fire, weakened it, marked his flesh with coal black scars. His mother's arms couldn't warm him anymore. And so his light faded, almost entirely. And the child of fire turned into the child of embers. Lord. A dark era began. Men forgot about him, but we did not. This flame, 
is the last gleam of his light. Our hope, and now two of you, a woman and a child, will carry it through his night. You, your heads are bent. Your humility honors you. You will walk his flame through his darkest hours. Take it. You will walk in his steps. Know the cold that bites the flesh, the drowning in the absence of light, the uncertainty. You will see the child die through the eyes of his mother. You will be the victim and the witness. Keep that torch alive at all costs. The carriers have been chosen. Take your places. What do we do? We have to play along. Let's cross. Go forth and bring him the light. Much depends on it. glow in the dark. I am the mother, and I welcome him. Pass it to me. You did well. The child must rise again. Hear me, child. I am not barren anymore, for your flame lives in me. I am the mother. Become the phoenix, the child of fire reborn. Join us. Blow on these flames. <gasps> the Phoenix. It's the Phoenix. Shh. Yes, I see it. It's real. Even if it is the order, it's all true. May, May the breeze of life ignite his flame. Hey, it's me. May the breeze of life reignite his flame. 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 Delcy, we're gone. Not for now. We all look the same. Unbelievable. No kidding.
A child's throne. He... he left here. Their child of embers. There's no child of embers. I told you about the order. This place belonged to them. And this child on the frescoes? It's the carrier of the Prima Macula. The Prima Macula. This just gets better and better. Alchemists call it the first corruption. It awoke in Hugo's blood when he was a baby. It keeps growing inside him. And it's killing him. That's what this whole place is about. The advent of a carrier of the macula. The order gathering around him, studying him, trying to find a solution. And the rats. Let me guess. Death, war, disease, and famine. Not only. The rats are... Anyway, they got it all wrong. There's no child of embers that will come and save the world. It's a fantasy they crafted to fit their hopes. All of it sounds like a crazy fantasy to me. Part of it is true. The part that can save him. The only part that matters. Basilius and Aelia. Nothing's changed. That water's not magic. The water? Oh, from the healing pond in your dream. It's like a symbol. Like mother's alchemic joints. Stagnating water is rarely magic. Hey, come see. That's his throne. And this, I think, is his name. Basil? He was a carrier just like you. You're not the only one. That's why you dreamt of all this. Something called you here, and for a good reason. I mean, look at this place. If there's a cure, it has to be here. And who is Aelia? It looks like there is more to this place behind here. Let's keep looking. Come. I'm sure there are extraordinary things waiting. <laughs> What's all this? Are we the first to come in here? Oh, a tent! You're right. It looks untouched. Too sacred for them, maybe? Hey, do you know whose room it is? It is. It's Basilius's room. Just imagine. He was living here, playing here, sitting where you sit. Isn't that astonishing? Yes. And he loved tents, just like you. You love tents? Me too. He had a phoenix. Yes. Maybe he dreamt the same dream as you. Let's see what else he left us. So that was his bed. It's beautiful. This Basilius was treated like a king. Maybe he was a king. King Basilius. It's a lovely horse. It's your size. Pretty sure he was your age. Yes. Look at that. Hmm. They're people. Important ones, maybe? Prophets? Are there prophets in the order? They're villains. I think he shot at them with this ball here. Hmm, <laughs> makes sense. Boys. I like this game too. Come, we've barely started. Wow. That's a 
warrior's room. Not just any warrior. Look at the shape of the armor. What of it? It's a lady's armor. Oh, Aelia. This is her room, of course. She was his protector. Protector? The carrier's personal guard. Like me for Hugo. She looked strong. Sword and spears. Wow, look at the axe too. I wonder if they were put to use. They built this place to avoid it. The carrier draws attention. Valuable tiny creatures. Look, wax tablets. They're carved. He drew her. And there, he drew himself with her. He loved her. It looks like they spent a lot of time together. Just like us. This is so strange. It is. Let's keep on. Toys. He was coming here to play with her. And she let him. She was the best kind of knight. I would have loved to meet them. This is crazy. I feel like... Like I know them. Like Basil could have been my friend. I know what you mean. Oh, look! Huh. That bird again. Its shape. It's the Order's symbol. The Phoenix is the Order. It's just that. Um, sorry, boy. But no! That explains why it stands above the child on their frescoes. They thought they were better than him. They didn't care about him. It doesn't change why we're here. Come, let's finish this first, right? Hmm. I'll be damned. What's this now? An alchemy laboratory. Can we go back now? But it looks exactly like what you're searching for, no? Yes, but... <laughs> no, you're right. Look for anything that could lead to an elixir. A, a potion, like books, drawings, maybe raw materials. On it. That. Oh, I don't even know what it's used for. Come on, give me something. There's nothing much. Oh. A phoenix. Look for a phoenix. What were they making in these things? Lord, give me something, please. This is all centuries old. What do you expect? Empty. No! What the hell? Hey! Quieter. We'll find something. Uh, sorry. Lucas would know. He would. This um, Hugo. I think the little Did you one find needs something? you, Amicia. This yes. table. They put him on it. Wait, I'm coming. An Athenor. <sighs> no. Whatever's been cooked in there is long gone. This place is crazy. Hey, something's wrong? I'm sure they hurt him, too. Hey, I know things aren't turning out the way you expected, but... Nothing ever changes, Amicia. But Aelia wouldn't let them hurt him, right? You... You let done? No! I... I tried to stop it, but... I, I know. You tried. Sorry. Hey, come here, you two. Sophia, where are you? Upstairs. How did you get there? Look behind the curtains. Hugo. What is this? No door. Some sort of uh, observation hallway? Oh. 
What have you found? Your alchemist library. Looks like they were observing the child from here. Like he was in a cage. We're right above the laboratory table. It's wrong. Imagine these bastards standing there, looking at him. We have to focus on what they learned. I may have a lead. Any mention of a kill? No, but they took other notes. What is it? Your alchemists wrote down everything that happened to the carrier. It's sorted by date. The last entry was in the year 541. 541? What does it say? I haven't studied Latin since the convent, but it talks about Basilius. And, uh, um, Alia Dragus, his protector. It really did all happen. They were just like us. What happened to them? The Order took away the carrier from her. She rebelled and was arrested close to a round tower. They took her to a, a, a capella, a, a chapel inside a fort. And Basilius, where is he? It doesn't say. Well, we have something to go on. A fort, a round tower. They're coming. We're lucky they didn't come sooner. Yes, let's get out of here fast. May this putrid water seal our determination. To stand by your side, day and night. I feel your sickness. I share your pain. We will protect you. We will care for you. I am the father. I am waiting for you. I am the mother. I am waiting for you. Join us. Whenever you feel ready, we are. Spend a full week at sea with my crew. Changes your notion of stench forever. That was enough for me. Let's go to that fort. Hugo? There was no fort in my dream. Maybe. But your dream put us on the right track. Look at all we've learned. 
Now we just have to find out the rest. Don't you want to know what happened to that Aelia? And your ancestor? It's going to be all right. Um, can we take these stinky clothes off now? Yes, we should. <laughs>